Hey, 15 riddles that will blow your socks off. Some advice here. Please make sure you're not wearing shoes. It could get ugly when those socks blow off. So, are you ready for some challenging riddles? Then let's see how many of these puzzles you'll manage to get right. Just beware though, most people can't even crack half of them. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to join us on the bright side. Now after each riddle, you'll get 10 seconds to figure out the solution before you're shown the answer. If you need more time to think, hey, you can always pause the video. You all set? Great! Then let's get started. Number 1. What's the missing letter? W, L, and then what? Use your lateral thinking to find the connection. It's the letter A, of course. W stands for water, since that's where you'll find a boat. L is for land, where cars get around. So that must mean A stands for air, where planes fly. Number 2. Why not? People in the Arctic may have extreme difficulty finding food and even starve to death if they can't. But they'll never ever eat a penguin. Why is that? Can they be that protective of these cute waddling birds? The answer's simple. People can't eat penguins in the Arctic because there aren't any in the north. These birds live in the southern Antarctic. Number 3. Family Ties if I'm the only brother-in-law of your mother's brother, who am I? <laughs> How good are you at family connections? You have 10 seconds to crack this puzzle. Well, I'm your father. Luke, I am your father. <laughs> Number 4. Time Travel What is yesterday's tomorrow and tomorrow's yesterday? Get to thinking. 10 seconds isn't a lot of time to solve this time travel riddle. And the answer is today. Number 5. Which letter is missing? A, B, C, D. Huh. Do you remember your ABCs? Hey, hold on now! The answer isn't as straightforward as it seems. The countdown has begun. The missing letter is F. See? Put it there, and we get the letter E. Number 6. The man who was robbed. A man walked into a police station. He said he had been robbed on his way to the bank. He was carrying a briefcase with a large sum of money when some guy wearing a black mask and gloves attacked him. The robber snatched the briefcase and ran away. The police officer listened to the victim and asked him about a fresh cut on his right cheek. The man replied it was from a silver ring the criminal had been wearing when he punched the poor victim in the face. After that, the officer immediately knew that the man was lying. But how could he figure that out? You have 10 seconds to sharpen your detective skills and solve this mystery. The man couldn't have possibly known that the robber was wearing a silver ring. After all, the attacker had gloves on. Number 7. Life is unfair. After a particularly heavy snowfall had let up, Daniel went outside and discovered there was twice as much snow in his yard than in his neighbor's. But Daniel didn't look surprised at all. How come? Try to shovel your way to the truth in the next 10 seconds.
There's no mystery to this whatsoever. Daniel's yard is two times bigger than his neighbor's. Number 8. How about a date? Number 4 yesterday was the 16th, then what date will the day after tomorrow be? You might need a calendar to crack this one. The correct answer is the 20th. Number 9. Anne's Weird Food Preferences Anne likes tomatoes, but not potatoes. She eats grapes, but not lettuce. She loves peas, but can't stand onions. She can eat cucumbers, but avoids carrots. So, can you figure out if this picky girl prefers apples or pumpkins? Anne will always choose a good orange pumpkin because she only eats fruits and veggies that grow on a vine. Number 10. A missed birthday. A girl was 10 on her last birthday, but she'll be 12 on her next birthday. How is it possible? No birthday skipping here! The girl is having her 11th birthday today. Speaking of 11, here's number 11. What letter is missing? Take a look at this seemingly random assortment of letters. J, F, A, M, J, J, A, S, O, N, D. Can you figure out what letter should be between F and A? Well, to start with, these are the first letters of all the months from January to December. Therefore, the third letter will be M for March. Number 12. Who will Thomas like? Thomas likes Jeeps, but not vans. Apples, but not pears. Tennis, but not hockey. And Jimmy, but not Nick. So. Can you figure out if he'll like Hannah or Lisa? Thomas will like Hannah. He only likes things and people whose names have double letters in them. Hey, maybe he should get with Anne and her equally picky preference for vine fruits and veggies. No, that just adds up to disaster to me. Picky plus picky does not equal easy going. On to number 13, a problematic parrot. Once upon a time, a pet shop owner had a beautiful parrot for sale. And apparently, this parrot could speak. At least a sign on its cage said, this parrot repeats everything it hears. Intrigued, a woman decided to buy the bird. For two weeks, she tried to make the parrot speak, but it remained silent. After that, the woman ran out of patience and returned the bird to the store for a refund. However, the owner wouldn't make the deal, because he claimed that he never lied about the parrot. How is it possible? Ah, uh, you're gonna love this one. The sign said that the parrot repeated everything it heard. Unfortunately, the bird was deaf. Number 14. Hey, don't get mad at me, I'm just reading these things. Number 14. A cryptic location. You leave this place without ever having entered it. What is this location?
Ah, it's the hospital where you were born. Number 15. The Island on the Lake Mary is stranded on an island in the middle of an enormous deep lake. Mary can't swim, she doesn't have a boat, and the nearest town is on the shore 5 miles away from her. All she has is 3 ropes, each of them being 2 feet long. And still, 3 hours later, Mary reaches the town. How did she manage to escape from the island? Your 10 seconds have started. Got it? Guess what? It's winter, and the lake is frozen. That's why it wasn't a problem for Mary to simply cross the lake on the ice. Ooh, and here's a bonus! Here's another sequence of letters. M, T, W, F, S, S. What letter is missing in the middle? You still have just 10 seconds to figure it out. The missing letter is T. These seven letters stand for the days of the week – Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So, Brightsiders, how many riddles did you end up solving? Let us know down in the comments. Be sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends, and click subscribe to stay on the bright side of life. Die.